All right, guys. This is GameStop Dust Stop number 33. Um, got a whole bunch of stuff to show you. Got a lot of posters. I'm going to go through those first, and then we'll get to everything else. First, over here, we got some boxes with the posters. Just a generic PlayStation 1. Generic PlayStation controller one, PlayStation headset, um, Crystal Dynamics, I guess. Maybe that's a game. Not sure. There's two of those. And then NBA 2K16, two boxes of those. Then there's this really cool poster of Just Cuz 3, where he's like flying out of a, a helicopter or something like that. It's a freaking awesome poster right there. And then some propaganda crap for stupid what is sidekick controllers, fusion controllers. Um, here's a Tomb Raider poster, two pieces. That's the first piece, and that's the second piece. Go side by side. Um, Afterglow, two piece, but you don't care about that. Uncharted poster for PS4. Um, Halo 5 poster for Xbox One. Uh, dimension like half poster I don't know what poster this is but it's upside down need for speed poster huh I haven't seen that one that's new uh, Fallout 4 poster for Xbox one a Mario Tennis and something else poster Xenoblade Chronicles X a Uncharted Battlefront and Call of Duty Black Ops 3 poster. NBA 2K16 poster. Uh, Football Manager 2016 poster. Another Tomb Raider poster. Another Tomb Raider poster. And then finally we get to the Star Wars Battlefront posters. Which I have about a hundred of. This side. And then there's... side and like I said I have about a hundred of those so those are those posters I have that I found this time um, other stuff I found from GameStop is like their I don't know what you call this advertising stuff but this is like a carabiner to put on your keys or something and I got two whole packs of those um, bracelets the stretchy bracelets. I got two packs of those plus a few that are outside the packs. Some balloons. I got three packs of those and then some outside the packs. Some boom sticks, which are those things that people bang together at football games. And these big old rubber bands they put around boxes to like bundle Xboxes and other things with them. Then we got some empty cases over here. Um, two Wii Sport cases. Some of those cases and a the crew case for Xbox 360. Then we got this Xbox game add-on download from Xbox Store for Killer Instinct. Um, we have Assassin's Creed 3 Disc 1 single player. We've got Grand Theft Auto 5 Disc 1. And we've got NCAA Football 13 for PS3 Disc Cover. Just not the manual. Then we got the little divider for a, a Xbox 360 game. Dante's Inferno slip. And a Gears of War 2 slip cover. Um, I found this. It says Netflix instant streaming disc for the Wii. If anybody knows if I can just use that to get Netflix, um, let me know. Because that'd be awesome if I could just use that and get Netflix and I have to pay for it. I don't know if that's the case though. Um, Pokemon Black Nintendo DS case, obviously empty. There's never, I've never found any DS cases or any DS games in the case. Some people have, but I haven't. Um, two Wii things that go on the the uh, Wii covers to go on the remotes. A Wii stand, which are a dime a dozen, they're everywhere. This uh, USB adapter to wall. These stickers, I believe they are, and they're all still in the packaging. This one says, hashtag frag this, nuclear like a boss, and keep calm and strike them down, you'll win. Then there's this plexiglass holder for something. I don't know. 
I'm sure they had it hanging on the wall holding some type of advertising. Um, they had these Star Wars mugs in the stores. And I don't know if they did it on purpose or not. But there's one, two, three, four, five. And they broke the handles off. Um, I don't Like I said, I don't know if they did it on purpose or not. More than likely, they did. But who knows? I don't know. That back there came from the dollar store. It had its handle broken off. But I just had all this other stuff in it. That's why I actually kept it. Otherwise, I would have thrown it out. This bin right here came from uh, Bed, not Bed Bath & Beyond, Bath & Body Works. And we had some other stuff in that. Just kept it. One, it's actually a pretty good, nice cloth basket. And only one thing's messed up on it. And two, we had to have something to carry stuff in. At the dollar store, we found some kosher baby dills. Got how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven jars of those. Um, found like a, a, a turtle light or something to keep a turtle warm. See, top fin. I'm not sure what this is. Found this in the Office Depot dumpster. It had like this Ethernet cable in it. This feature guide clover manual. And then the clover packaging. So, or the little pouch. So I don't know what that is. This came from the dollar store. I think it's like a thing you put on your hand to clean a baby in the shower. I mean the tub. Um, dollar store, just a snowman. Solar powered thing. I don't know why I threw it out. Soap pads from the dollar store. Some disposable cups from the dollar store got ripped open, but all 12 of them are still there. Um, a flashlight from the dollar store. Don't know why they threw it out. Sunglass, sunglasses clip from the dollar store. Um, all these little scent things from the dollar store. I think one of them might have busted, so they threw them all out. And it got all of the box, so they threw them all out like they normally do with stuff like pickles. This is just some scrap metal I found because I don't think it's going to be, be able to use for what it was. It was like a mount to hang a TV, but I, there are some pieces taken out of the box, and I don't think that's going to work. Um, extreme Wear Nail Polish from the dollar store. It's not even open. I don't know why I threw it out. All those wires like I normally find, just a whole bunch of different ones. Um, a random kid's fishing pole this time. It works. looks like it was brand new, and they threw it in there, and it got dirty. I don't know why they threw a brand new fishing pole away, but... People are stupid. We, we've seen that. And then a yellow toner, still in the box, came from Office Depot, I think. I don't know if I can do anything with that. Um, if anybody else knows what I can do with that, let me know. I don't know of anywhere to sell it, where I'll actually be able to sell it. I don't even know what it's worth. And then down here on the floor, we've got some tools. Found some more tools this time. I'm not sure what that is. I think it's like a, a test light or something, but I don't know what you hook the other end up to. That's just some copper wire that I'm going to strip. This is like a file right here. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. These are like screw, screwdriver heads. Um, drill bit. Socket. Big socket. A small socket, which is actually a husky socket, so... You're stupid for throwing that away. Two um, pipe clamps. A drill. Uh, not a drill. A screwdriver. A drill bit. A drill bit. A smaller screwdriver down here. And a Allen wrench. And then all these are like shark bites and stuff. These are wire connectors. Wing nuts. Most people call them wing nuts. And then all this other stuff down here is like shark bites and stuff used in plumbing and electrical work and other stuff like that. I think it was a plumber that went out of business or something. And then I found these two things right here, which are just water jugs, and I think you can turn those in for money. And finally, I found this at GameStop. Fallout 4, big old pre-order your copy today poster. I'm not poster, standee that goes in the store. Um, I think that's pretty cool. I, I guess my brother's going to keep it. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.